um, I will be traveling inshallah in, uh, in a week or so. So, uh, so I know the rule, you know, you can shorten combined prayers while traveling, but, uh, but when I reach the destination, uh, can I still uh, use it? Or like, can I still apply the, the rule? How long will you be staying in that destination? A week or two. Well, have you decided yet? Do you know how long exactly or you not decided? Well, I will be. Uh, I, I mean, I, I will be. I will be in. A, I will be in. I will be in an apartment with my father. I will be staying there for a week or two. Again, it's it, his. Uh, again, it's his uh, residency. I know. Again, it doesn't matter where will you be residing in a hotel room or in somebody's house, or even if you have a condo there. It's about how many days uh, are you planning to stay. If you know for sure you will be staying there for one week. Then once you arrive from day one, you pray regular and the Sunan as well. But I'm going to visit my father and I'm not really sure how long would it take me to finish his business or to hang around with them. Then once I'm okay, I'll be leaving or I'm going for a mission with a company. So it may take three, four, five days or 10 days. I'm not sure. If you're not sure, then so long as you're staying, you shorten and you may combine the prayer. But if I know I have a return ticket, or I have an appointment back home, where I will be returning in three days or in four days, then my friend, you're allowed to shorten the prayers and combine them. But uh, my return ticket is actually in two weeks. I know that I will be staying for two weeks. Then in this case, from day one, you pray regular. Barakallah feek almen.